Uh, I mean, today's mission we receive a big donation from a f um, retired fire department chief in Port Port Jervis, New York. Uh, so we receive a lot of like uh, fire used fire uh, fire equipment, and we are preparing to ship it to Ukraine. Also, we have uh, a lot of um, supplies for first aid kits, uh, individual first aid kits, as well as tactical backpacks. Together, uh, Razom uh, is together for Ukraine. I mean, if not us, who who else can be? Like, uh, of course, government, but government has much bigger issues than. Um, yeah, much bigger issues and we just trying to help our country. I was born in Ukraine. Many people here were born in Ukraine. So it's, it's, it's our like, it's, it's our duty. Uh, I didn't, I didn't have like in, in, in my worst dream that war will last so long. And right now it's, it become I mean, I'm embarrassed to say, but it's become a kind of like a, a, a norm. Uh, they kind of refugees helping refugees. And even today we have, a, I believe, at least one person that I know from the top of my head, she's helping us today as well. Uh, my name is Valeria. My name is Valeria Rashkovan. Uh, I live in Ukraine, uh, Konotop city, and now I live in Brooklyn. Ukraine. <laughs> Найперше, що мене змусило поїхати, це страх за свою доньку, за життя своєї доньки. Бо наше місто було в облозі, в кільці ворога. Вони стояли на всіх виїздах, на всіх дорогах з нашого міста. Артилерія була направлена на наше місто. І щодня майже ми були... О, я гадаю, що це дуже потрібно, саме тому я тут і саме тому я допомагаю разом. Бо якби не волонтери, якби не міжнародні організації, ми навряд чи б на початку війни взагалі витримали цю навалу. А, ти Тирисан ти? Де ти зараз тепер живеш? В Брукліні. В Брукліні, ну блін, це зараз таке місце. Everybody has a valuable mission for the place they've been placed and if we've been more lucky, I would say, to be on a safe place, so we should be giving as much as we can to the people who have been much less lucky to be in the war zone and be bombarded by all this. 